The cut in diplomatic relations ended a relationship between Honduras and Taiwan that had lasted more than 80 years. In a weekend joint statement with China, the Honduran Foreign Ministry said the government of the People's Republic of China is the sole legal government representing the whole of China, and Taiwan is an inalienable part of China's territory. In the capital, Tegucigalpa, residents hope the country's new diplomatic landscape will bring economic benefits. I think in the long term, this will be positive. It can bring the investment that this country needs. Formal diplomatic relations with Beijing were a pledge President Xiomara Castro made during her 2021 election campaign. Honduras had maintained ties with Taipei since 1941, a relationship that ended on Saturday when this country's foreign ministry released a statement establishing formal diplomatic ties with Beijing. Efrain Diaz is a former Honduran ambassador to the United Nations who welcomes the decision. This was a necessary decision, but the realities of the world today mean this had to change. I think it's the correct decision. In Central America, only Belize and Guatemala now remain allied to Taipei. Ricardo Salgado is the Honduran Minister of Strategic Planning, who says this new era of cross-Pacific relations reflects his government's aspirations. Our establishing of relations with China is aimed at intensive cooperation. When it comes to culture, trade, technology, education, we have a lot to learn from China's development and we believe their model is key in poverty eradication. Escuela en cuanto a la erradicación de la pobreza. One country casting a leery look at the shift is the U.S. Despite maintaining its own relations with Beijing since 1979, Washington has reacted with alarm when other nations have done the same. But Diaz says Honduras should make decisions without external influence. Honduras is a sovereign nation. We don't base our foreign policy on what the U.S. will think. And the idea that this will result in some sort of apocalypse is exaggerated. Alastair Babastock, CGTN, Tegucigalpa, Honduras.